I'm not gonna lie, my first impression is that I feel very rushed. <laughs> channel welcome back to another video welcome back to my world today i am super excited we are going to be trying the express rent a wardrobe or as they like to call it express style trial but doesn't rent a wardrobe just sound so much better anyways if you are new to my channel hello my name is anna i am a food blogger that does youtube videos on mukbangs and fashion and clothes sometimes and food so if any of that interests you press the like and the subscribe or maybe i don't know if you like my face maybe you can subscribe you know i like it when people click the subscribe button I think I'm on like 93 subscribers now or something, so I am so stoked. I'm like wondering if I should do something special when I hit 100 subscribers, but I don't really know what to do. I was thinking like dye my hair, but then that sounds like something that you would say for a thousand subscribers, or maybe like eat a spicy pepper, but then I might die, so maybe not that either. I don't know. Let me think about it. I don't know what I'm wearing today. Don't ask. I'm having a midlife crisis over here, or I'm having a quarter life crisis over here. <laughs> These are my boyfriend's pajama pants. Um, because his closet is now my closet and they're the best so would highly recommend getting a boyfriend and having access to their closet 10 out of 10 stars anyways so yeah Facebook is so good at knowing me and knowing who I am and knowing what I like their algorithm they're like always popping up all these different clothing subscription things and jewelry and makeup and god knows how much more money I've spent this year just because of Facebook but anyways, I got an advertisement for one free month of Express Style Trial. And so I decided to try it out, do a video, see what happens, and so we are here. So Express is Style Trial is not like Stitch Fix, where it's like a clothing subscription box that you purchase. It is a subscription box where you rent the clothes and wear them as many times for as long as you want and then return them or you can buy them for a reduced discounted price. So typically the monthly subscription costs $60 a month. So that's almost $2 a day. A little expensive if you ask me, but um, you know, that's just me. So this is what the website looks like. So you log into a portal and they show you all these different clothing that are available for you to rent. And they ask that the first thing you do is you build a closet. So you select 20 pieces of clothing that you would like to rent in your size. And then once you have 20 pieces, and then that triggers the next step, which is where Express chooses three pieces from your closet and ships it out to you. So the interesting thing is, is number one, you can prioritize the pieces out of those 20 pieces that you would like sooner rather than later, but you cannot flat out choose which pieces you want right away unless you pay an extra $3. So for an additional $3, you can choose the clothing that you want specifically in each box. But if you're just doing the $60 a month, they choose for you and send it. My first impression is that most of these clothes are not really my style, like super my style. They're very formal, very classy. A lot of work appropriate clothing, not a lot of like super fun, casual, cleavagey, booty showing type of clothes, <laughs> which is my style. I will admit it. I like showing off. These clothes are really nice, but they do seem like they're either for formal occasions or for a work setting. The other thing that I was a little disappointed about was that a lot of the cute clothing was not available in my particular size. So for bottoms, I'm usually like a large or like a 10, and tops, I'm a small, and then jumpsuits, God knows, somewhere in between. So a lot of the cute clothing, unfortunately, wasn't available in my size, and when it's not available in my size, I can't add it to my closet. So that kind of sucked because there were a few cute pieces that I really had my eye on that were just not available to me because the only size they had would be like extra large or extra, extra small. But once again, that's just me. So I logged in, I picked my 20 pieces, and they sent me the first box three days after I chose those 20 pieces. And then I got my package, I think another three days later. So total like five to seven days from when you first sign up is when you're going to get your first box. Great, right, let us look at 
the pieces. I pre-opened the box for myself so that I would not have to embarrass myself on camera. Also, each box only has three items, which I personally feel like if you're gonna go through all the trouble of shipping and packing and sending a box to someone, it should have four items or even better, five items. I feel like three items is not a lot. Like you could wear that in two days and then you're already sending it back. All right, this is item number one. <laughs> okay, do you guys think this is work appropriate? Like, is this work appropriate? It is, right? I have no idea how this is going to look at me, but I feel like I'm going to look like a sexy funeral attendant. <laughs> I'm gonna look like a sexy widow in this. <laughs> Second item is a pair of leather jogger pants. Whoa. Oh, these are big. These might be too big. Oh yeah, these really might be too big. And they don't have like a drawstring either. So these are in a size large. These are definitely worth might be too big for me. Unfortunately, they don't have like a drawstring, so you can't really like, you know, close it around your waist. So I got one top, one bottom, and one jumpsuit in a size medium. I mean, this is fun. I like it. So I like how the three pieces they sent are all different pieces. It's not like three tops or three bottoms or three blazers. So that's nice. And so hopefully what I'm gonna do is after this, I'm gonna send these back and then see how long it takes to get the second box. I kind of made an oopsie. I was hoping that I could get this box and film and then send it back like right away. But then I kind of got like caught up in life and I kind of got like really depressed. So it's been a week since I've gotten this box instead, which kind of sucks. Hopefully I have enough time to get a second box before the trial ends because I'm not looking to spend $60 on this, but I Crossed. <laughs> All right, so I will go try this stuff out right now. Oh god, I'm so hungry. <laughs> you know, whenever people think about going to the gym a lot, because like I almost go to the gym every day now, not trying to like flex or anything, but I do try to work out a lot to kind of, you know, offset my lifestyle. Everyone's like, yeah, gains, like, ooh, looking swole. Oh yeah, check out my arm muscles. How do they look? What do you think? They look good? Yeah? <laughs> But nobody talks about how when you start working out, you are literally hungry all the damn time. Like I can literally not eat enough. It's crazy because before I could get a double chicken from Chipotle, load it with sour cream and cheese, and I would be full for the rest of the day. Now I could get a Chipotle that's like 1500 calories and I will be hungry within three hours. Like three hours later, I'll be like, la di da, just like doing something. And then I'll be like, and then my stomach rumbles and I'm like, oh my God, I could eat a cow. I could eat a whole cow right now. I could eat everything in the fridge right now. I am so fucking hungry. Like you'll just feel like going about your day being a normal person and then out of nowhere, the hunger just hits you like a load of bricks. And you're like, oh my God, I've never been so hungry in my life. Like what the hell is going on? One side effect of working out all the time is you will be hungry the moment you wake up in the morning and you will be hungry the moment you go to sleep <laughs> the moment your bed hits the pillow at night. And I also do the fasting. I do 18, what is it, 18-6? No, 18-8. I also do 18-8, no, no, 16-8. I also do 16-8 fasting, which makes it even harder because I had to fast through the hunger. Anyways, just, just a side thing. I love working out though, it's amazing. So, all right, all right, first outfit. <laughs> pants are so big and I'm trying to hold them up with a clip. But seriously, like who makes jogger pants for women and does not put like a tie? Like most of these pants are not gonna fit your average woman because we are curvy. We oftentimes have bigger butts and smaller waists. Like first impression. Okay, just imagine though that these are like tighter. Ooh. These are tighter and they're like here. What do you guys think? I am not gonna lie, my first impression is that I feel very Russian. Okay, so when I do this, what I'm thinking in my head is like, you know when people wanna emphasize something and they're typing it, they put like those little like diamonds or like the little like shiny spots. You know what I'm saying? Like they're like, I'm feeling, and then they put like this, like the, what are they like stars? Happy, like stars or something like that. Do you guys know what I'm saying? I'm not, or do I sound like a crazy person? Like those sparkly diamonds that you put on like either side of a word to like really emphasize it. When I'm doing this hand gesture, that's what I mean. I'm like, I'm feeling Russian. 
This top is definitely something a Russian mom would wear to Russian church. And these pants are definitely something a young Russian teenager would wear to Russian church. No joke. You've got the Russian, you've got the joggers, and you know us Russians love joggers. And these are stylish leather joggers, so even better. And this is definitely the kind of top that a, a Russian mom would wear to church with her Chanel bag. Yeah, I just like, I, I don't know. I don't know how to explain it, guys. I like, I'm looking at myself in the mirror and I'm like, I feel so connected to my Russian heritage in this outfit. Like, I feel connected to my Russian roots. I feel this part of me just coming alive wearing this outfit. Anyways, this is the first outfit. These pants are very hot, as expected, because they're leather. Very trendy, uh, very baggy. I don't know if I would wear this together into an office. If you work at a progressive company, maybe you could get away with wearing this type of outfit to work. I just, I feel kind of fashionable. I don't know, I feel like I'm, I'm, uh, I'm breaking some ground here in this outfit. Ding dong! Must be that lip that I ordered. <laughs> I told you guys I watch way too many TikToks. Okay, here is the third and last one. What do you guys think? I'm kind of digging this. This is a medium. It's interesting because it feels a little loose up top, like it feels like the shoulders are falling off, but then the waist, actually it's stretchy. I gotta say, this is pretty comfortable. It's not like too tight. It feels very like flowy on the body. I'm afraid that the top is gonna fall off randomly, which is what it's doing and I will expose everyone. But besides that, I kind of feel like I'm going to like a goth disco, you know what I mean? Like this is totally like a disco outfit, but it's black. I like this. I think it's really sexy. I just don't know where I personally would wear it. I guess I would wear this to like a nice dinner. Yeah, or maybe to like get drinks somewhere. I don't know if I would wear this in general because it just doesn't feel like my style. I like how it's shiny though. It's definitely fabulous. But this is one of the things that you can rent in the express style trial. And I guess you, you probably can't see my feet. It is a little long for me, so I would have to wear heels on this. And I am 5'7 for reference. This is cute. It's comfortable. Ooh, you know where you could wear it for a good place to be? On a cruise for dinner. And then you go to the dance club afterwards and you're like, I don't know how to dance. <laughs> okay guys, so that is it for this part of the video. I'm going to go drop this off at USPS and this is falling. <laughs> Would be good for me not to flash you guys right now. Although I'm sure you would like that. So I'm going to go take my clothes off and then ship this box back. So the next segment of this video, I'll let you guys know how long it takes from when I send this box back to when I get my next box. And I'll show you the outfits in there. So my first impression is, I personally would not have a use for this box because I'm a freelancer that works from home. So my clothes are mostly casual. I don't really wear clothes like this, clothes like this very often. I think that this type of box is really worth it if you work in a place that has a dress code and has a more formal working environment that requires you to wear suits and slacks and blazers, X, Y, Z. And that's because number one, work clothes can be really expensive. Like blazers and blouses and slacks can be hundreds of dollars. And then number two, if you only have say like five to 10 pieces of clothing that's for work, you get bored of that really easily. So this is a good subscription box for if you don't wanna spend a ton of money buying work clothes and you constantly wanna keep it fresh and wear new, cute, fun clothes to work. And you know, not get bored of wearing the same black slacks and the same gray blazer to work every single day. That's actually one thing I hated about working in an environment with a dress code. Number one, dress clothes are so uncomfortable. They're uncomfortable, they're expensive, they're boring, and I personally really didn't like it. I'm sure other people do, I just didn't. This box is worth it if that's the kind of job you have because $60 a, a month is kind of a lot, but in terms of work clothes, $60 can get you maybe like two work blouses and that's it because those things are so expensive. Brand new, of course, not secondhand. So that's my thoughts for now. I'm so hungry, I can't think straight. And I will let you guys know if I don't have enough time to send this back and get another one before my one month trial ends. Hopefully I do. We'll see what three items we get in the next box. Let me show you guys my new nail color. Okay, so right now it's white. It looks white, but if I put my nails under cold water, they turn dark purple. 
Sorry guys, I don't know. I'm still so awkward. I'm just a really awkward person. If you ever meet me in real life, I am super awkward because I get super bad social anxiety. So I'm just like, hi, how are you doing? <laughs> That's exaggerating a little, but in real life, I'm definitely awkward. You know, I'm thinking today we'll get all you can eat sushi. That's what I'm feeling. It's a good day for all you can eat sushi. Mm, yes, please. So yeah, I will see you guys in the second half of this video. I hope you guys are having an amazing day. Love you. See you later. Hey guys. Okay, so I just got my second express style trial box. And for this one, I did decide to utilize the dart feature. I think I already explained it, but dart is that extra service that you can pay for where for $7, you can choose the three pieces that you get and they ship it out immediately next day instead of the three to four turnaround there seems to be in between boxes after they receive your previous box. I did that because number one, my trial is going to end soon and I do not want to be charged $60. And number two, I wanted to actually pick pieces that I knew I would be interested in hypothetically if I were to use this service and not just be given like really random pieces that are in my closet. I will have to say I was a little disappointed in that out of the like 40 things I had in my closet, in my virtual closet on their website, there was only like 10 items available to be darted to me. So it was actually a very, very small selection that was available for me to choose from for my next box, which kind of sucked because at first I only had like 25 pieces in my closet. And then when I clicked on dart, the only thing that avail was available was like one top and two skirts. And I was like, well, that's not really what I want. So I went and I added an additional like 20 items to my closet just to be able to have a little more selection. And yes, I am wearing my pajamas. Thank you for asking. All right, so the first item I decided to get was a going out dress because I mean, what do I, what do I mean? <laughs> I don't know what I mean. <laughs> So of course I decided to go for a going out dress because a lot of times you want to wear going out dresses and then you know you don't want to wear them again after buying them according to some friends I have anyways. So with the service it's cool because then you know you can borrow the going out dress and wear it and look fabulous and look and take your pictures and then return it. I hope that point made sense. But anyways, so this is like a, it's a long sleeve. It's thick. It's um what is this called? velvet, like a velvet dress. We'll see how that looks. And then I got some pants. Hopefully these fit me. These feel really nice. I just loved like the double buttons. I was like, I have to, I have to try these on. This is a 10. So hopefully they'll fit me. They are like capri length, which is interesting. I mean, I'm not gonna lie. I would, I would wear these to work. So we'll see. And then, whoa, this is thick. And then a blazer to go with the pants it has thick shoulders. I don't know what else to say about this blazer. It's a charcoal blazer. I don't know what else you want. Okay, so let's go try them on and um, see see what you think. All right, guys, here is the first item. What do you think? So this is a size medium. It fits pretty well. It's a little bit loose, so maybe I could have gotten away with a small, maybe. But I think it's really cute. I think that it looks formal and kind of sexy, but not too sexy. I'm almost trying to think of like an occasion I would wear this because I wouldn't wear this to like a club or going out because it has like long sleeves. So it would get super hot and probably really sweaty. I guess maybe to like a really nice dinner where you're really trying to, you know, show off. Even though it's like tight, it's not crazy show off everything tight, you know what I mean? But it is really nice and it's really comfortable. I don't know, does it ride up? It rides up a little bit, definitely a tiny bit. But yeah, the crazy thing is, I totally forgot to mention this. If I wanted to buy this, it is only $11. Like this dress and the jumpsuit that I showed in the previous video was only $15. So this is actually a crazy great way to get used express clothing for really cheap if you wanted it. I mean, this dress is $11, only $11. And you know, obviously they like wash it and dry clean it and whatever before sending it to me. So and in my eyes, this is like almost brand new. It looks and it feels brand new. There's like no signs of wear or anything. The blazer and 
pants are much more expensive. They're like $60 a piece or something crazy. But it looks like if you get like going out pieces, like dresses or like that jumper, you can get them for super cheap. I, I might like just keep this dress just for the heck of it. I mean, it's only $11. Like I'm sure I can find somewhere to wear it for $11. <laughs> sexy in this in this blazer and this these pants it's like i'm like looking at myself in the mirror i'm like damn i want to go back to work like give me like a nine to five that i can like wear this to so these pants are a 10 and this jacket is a small it's really really comfortable i'm not gonna lie i don't know if i wore the right tank with this but whatever i just i don't know i feel so like cool and like posh Whew. If I worked a 9 to 5, I would totally use express style, whatever, and like wear amazing outfits like this all the time. Like, I mean, like, look at me. I don't know, is it just me? So this is what the, the pants look like. They're pretty comfortable. They are low, like very low rise, which I generally like things mid rise to high rise, but whatever. They don't make me look like the skinniest person in the world, but that's work pants for you. And I love like the double buttons. That was the reason why I really wanted these. I know you can't see the ankles, but they're slightly above ankle bone length. So they're definitely a little on the shorter side, which I also like, by the way. This jacket is like really thick and warm. The quality is like, it's pretty good. I'm not gonna lie. It just looks so hot. <laughs> like, look at me. Don't tell me that you wouldn't hire me if I walked in wearing this. Like, come on. You know you would. Let me give you my resume. <laughs> That's it for the Express Style Trial or the Express Ward re re Express Rental Wardrobe. So I could see this being really useful if you are in a very particular work situation. I'm like imagining almost like a like a Devil Wears Prada type of situation where you're like an assistant to like a fashion designer. Or, is that what she is? I don't even know. I haven't watched that movie in forever. But you have a very particular job that requires you to look really good all the time and you know you constantly want to be wearing like new and fresh pieces but you obviously don't have the money to keep buying the new and fresh pieces and you just really want to freshen and you just really want to keep it spicy and you know you also have a lifestyle that requires you to like go out a lot maybe with like clients at night so you always got to be looking good for that then I could really see justifying the $60 a month plus maybe dart for an extra seven dollars if you wanted it to obviously for me you know the kind of person that just bums at home most of the day and doesn't see the sunlight for weeks at a time probably not the greatest uh, investment but i can definitely see certain people making this really worth their money for sure yeah so the jacket is 60 and the pants are 70 so a little more on the pricey side but i gotta admit these clothes are really good quality and they're incredible incredibly comfortable like so many work pants out there especially for women they are like tight in all the wrong places they're uncomfortable they're not stretchy and they're stiff these pants are stretchy they definitely have like a bit of like a yoga pants feeling to them while you know also obviously looking professional so i gotta give it to express their work clothes are really comfortable and i would love to wear this kind of clothing to the office and you know look like a boss ass bitch <laughs> But um, yeah, so that's it for the video, guys. Let me know what you think below and whether you're going to try it or whether you'd like to try it. Uh, I'm like, I'm really tired and kind of out of it today. So definitely had a bit of a hard time with my words this video. Love you guys. Mwah. I hope you have a fabulous day. Let me see what color my, oh, you see. See, my nails now are purple and they were like white in the last video, remember? Give a like. And a subscribe if you liked the video or if you want to see more videos like this. Always love hearing from you guys, so leave a comment below if you can. Um, or send me a DM on Instagram or whatever. I always love chatting with you guys. Definitely makes my day. Bye!